feel in the game then today? Uh, look, I'm happy in the end to take a point. Um, we wasn't at our best today, you know. We, we, we said that in the dressing room. The boys are honest with themselves, and I'm honest with them as well. You know, we've been very good over the last couple of weeks, but we wasn't at our best today. So to get a point out of the game, I just said to him that's a positive thing. We haven't played well. We managed to stick in there and you know get a late equaliser. Um, of course, I wanted three points before the game, but um, when you come in and you've not played well and you still manage to take something out of the game, I think that's a good sign for the boys. Yeah, is this something to be concerned of the home form of late? Extra draws in there. Look, it is what it is at the moment. You know, we do we're averaging probably you know four points every two games, but um, but that's by getting away wins. You know, it's putting more pressure on our away form. And luckily, our away form's been very good. Um, look, I want to win games at home. I definitely do. You know, the boys are desperate to win games at home as well. But for whatever reason, just right at the moment, we, we can't quite get them. But um, if they keep working hard and keep you know trying to improve and keep doing the stuff that they've been doing. I'm sure that I turn around. Um, we're, we're more than capable to win games at home, you know, and I think if we want to get to where we want to be at the end of the season, you know, we've got to start winning home matches because it's putting pressure on our way from which we've been very good at, but you know, we don't want to put too much pressure on it. Sometimes you might need to take a draw away from home and then you want to make sure you back that up with a home win. So we uh, followed up a good performance in the midweek where we got the three points and then we'd love three points again today. We were all desperate for that. Um, but to take a point, you know, it's four points out of the last two games, which I'll take that at the start of the week. Yeah, and another set piece goal to get that vital goal at the end there. That's something you've been working on. Being honest, it, you know, we can't take too much credit as, a, as staff on that sort of stuff. You know, it comes down to at that moment, you know, someone like Yates who's got a quality delivery, you know, and was, you know, a lot of people are talking about, oh, they're good some set plays and trying to stop it. But I, I said to the boys before the game, you know, if, if the delivery's right and you've got the people attacking the ball and wanting to get on the end of it, um, if Yates puts the ball in the right area and Maka's got a chance of getting his head on it, he's going to score. It's just that's just the way it is. And you know, Andy knows Maka better than me. He would have been saying he's a threat, but it's one thing in knowing how to stop him. Um, and actually being able to do it, you know, the the bowling was great, and there was another great header by Maka. And lastly, Hesse returning to Silver Lake today, was nice to see him. Of course it was, you know, it was it was great to see him, and you know, credit to his team, you know, I don't, um, I'm not one of these managers that go like, well, we didn't play well that night. They, I actually, you know, credit to them, they they caused us a lot of problems today, you know. Hess knows the way we play, and Jeffrey, the boy out wide, you know, was carrying the football for them, caused us a big threat, and um, you know. Looking at that team today, you know they'll they'll be in a good position coming into the season. You know he's he's got them got playing now, and he, but he's a good manager, you know, and he knows he knows this level very really well. So there was no surprises from us that it was going to be a tough game. You know they went away to Bournemouth in midweek, who made the playoffs last year and won, um, beat Harley Paul on Saturday. So I think they got themselves going on a little bit of a run today. Um, but yeah, it was great to see him, and I'm sure I'll have a sit down with him now and have a good catch up and um, talk about the game.